Okay, so let's do a little quick recap. First of all, we create our socket um, and we're binding that on localhost. This is a tuple. Um, so the first one is the localhost and then we do it on port 80. We listen for five uh, connections, okay? After that, down in the while true here, this is saying that we're constantly listening for things. Um, we get a, we build up a connection based upon the accepted uh, adder, which is the accepted request, um, and we grant that request. We set we create a request based on the uh, received um, buffer size, and then what we can do is we can create a a body of the response. So this becomes our web page, right, which we've defined up here, and then below this, what we're doing is we're setting the headers, which I'm just going to double check my notes and just because I'm, you know, I'm bound to do something wrong here, aren't I? HTTP uh, slash 1.1, 200 OK, there's no spaces between that, that's fine. And then we do can content underscore type, that's OK, I think this can even be in lowercase. And then it's text forward slash HTML, that's good. And then the next one is connection close, and then and then I've got two ends. That's good. And then after this, we we send the body to all of it. So we send all the body. Body is the web page that we've just put in. Uh, and then we close the connection. So that should be the thing that is returned when we get to this IP address. And if I can get this done, I am going to buy a cake for myself this lunchtime <laughs> because I couldn't get any of this to work this morning. I've had it working before, <laughs> but uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Here goes nothing. Uh, right. So we're going to push this up. So let's do um, CP of here, and we're going to go to run.py, and we're going to push this up to the Pi board. Wonderful. So that's up there. So I can uh, I can cat that out. So if I did cat of forward slash Pi board run dot uh, py, we have this, this is what we've just pushed up there. Um, and if I did an LS, we can see that we have our Wi-Fi secrets, test.py, oh, sorry, an LS of Pi board I should do. We've got boot.py, run.py, test.py, Wi-Fi secrets. So let's get into the ripple. Um, and... I'm going to get in my notes ready. I'm going to just grab a, another page. Bear with me just a second whilst I do that. A new window. Because if this works, I will demonstrate it. I'm going to get onto that um, IP address, which was in test.py, I believe. 192.168. I'm going to have that at the ready. I'm just going to paste that into my browser. Awesome. Okay, so we 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 are. The browser is kind. It it, it isn't running, but uh, it, it's uh, it's certainly um, ready. So now we're going to do an import of run. Okay. So remember, this is on a while true, right? So this is this is constantly looping. Well. Well, it looks like I'm going to have some cake this lunchtime. Check that out. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Hello, Twitch. This is the ESP board talking. This is a web server. We have got a web server running off of this ESP board. This means that I can now uh, fiddle around with this a little bit more, make some actual um, proper endpoints for this, and we can then rig this board up to the NeoPixel ring that I demonstrated uh, the other day, 
which I will demonstrate in just a second, I think, again. Um, oh, wow. So I have no idea why this, is, this wasn't working this morning. I have no idea why this wasn't working this morning. Uh, wow. Maybe it was only because I had, a, you know, I didn't have a lot of sleep.